back, right? So, if I come in here, I start to go for this lock, and Leo bends his elbow. What do I do? Well, same thing, but slightly different. Basic level, okay, the easiest level, as soon as he gives me this bend, I'm just going to rip through with another upward elbow strike. We're not going to practice that because that would destroy his shoulder, but the principle's there, just ripping through. And you can see he's already, it's already bringing his posture. If I continue with another el upward elbow strike, it's going to tear out the shoulder joint. What I can do, though, is same thing as before, but instead of gripping at the wrist, I'm going to grip up at the bicep, keeping his elbow very tight against my chest. Okay? He can't move it. He has no flexibility in, in this. Leo, try to move your arm. Nothing. Okay? I'm going to do the same takedown. I want to take him down behind me. So I've got to move this leg to create a space, an opening. I'm going to pick up this leg, drop him straight down, okay? And then from here, shoot this hand straight behind his head, and turn my body. Okay? Let's try that one but time. I do want you to get this part. So as I start to wrap, he's going to pull his elbow in. He's going to tuck his elbow in. Everybody can see? As he does that, I'm just going to continue, but I'm going to let my forearm take that elbow. And you can see here how it breaks his posture. He's wanting to go down because it actually is going to alleviate some of the pressure. And I'm just going to help him do that. Okay? And there's other options from here. So this is what I want to work through is just this. Okay? Any questions? We'll do it one more time. Uh, Maybe. This work. So one. Two, he bends that elbow, doesn't matter, I'm going to grab the bicep, okay, okay, let's work that.